Greetings, Earthlings. I'm Omar. Omar Petrus Vakar. Yep, all of that. Omar Petrus Vakar. I'm a musician from Washington, D.C. I've dedicated my entire life to my art. I play more than 10 instruments, and I have a degree in songwriting from Berklee College of Music. Not only that, on top of it, I also play Indian classical sitar. And I've dedicated over seven years to learning Indian classical music. I grew up performing in bands in DC, and the DC DIY punk scene was super influential to me as an artist. <laughs> As an artist, I've appeared on BBC, MTV, Voice of America, LA Times, Time Magazine, Rolling Stone, Alt Press, NBC, Newsweek. My music has been featured at Sundance, Festival Nouveau de Cinema. I've been in a bunch of books, Encyclopedia, as well as being in a bunch of other films. I've also been in a few documentaries, one of which you may recognize me from called Thakwa Kaur, The Birth of Punk Islam. I also scored that film. I also scored that film. I did. That's what I did. <laughs> I'm the best. Let me tell you a little bit about my music. I've got three current projects running right now. The first project is called Sarmast. See? There's like flying saucers, a Mughal mosque, elephants, and aliens. This is my indie rock band. We call it Mystical Dance Punk. a mixture between dance punk, proto-punk, stuff like Gang of Four, television, talking heads, 60s Bollywood, and Sufi devotional music. And the music has a lot of Indian classical influences, uses ragas on electric guitar. Sarmust is awesome. The second project is Evil Art Form. Evil Art Form started out as my early experiments into electronic music but then sort of evolved into this electro-Sufi catharsis thing. Where I uh, improvise songs using samples and drum machines, indie, electronic, alt-dance, experimental tape loop, kind of 808 music. It's heavily inspired by Nusrat Fateh Ali Khan, who's a Sufi singer, and you know artists like Bjork and Portishead. The third project is called Gardens for the Lush. Gardens for the Lush actually started out as a book, a book of poetry that I had written. We perform it alongside a Hindustani classical sitar improvisation, Khuzl poetry, which is a form of poetry popular in the Middle East, in Persia and South Asia. It's spoken word poetry with ethereal sitar. When I'm conscious of my heart, then I can soar in dreams. When I'm conscious of my heart, then I can soar in dreams. And I'm waking suddenly to find there's more in dreams. Oh. Ah. Thanks for taking your time to watch this video. You can check out all my websites and stuff below. There's more videos for you to check out as well. And please share this video and help me spread the word.